Hello friends, happy first full week of January 2022. Crazy to say that. Um, kicking off this vlog, happy Monday. We are going to stock the fridge. We're going to Trader Joe's and getting all of our shopping done. Um, we are also probably gonna drop off the car. This is my parents' car. If you don't know, we took that to Portland. Uh, check out our Portland vlog, it was very cute. Lots of fun places. Um, so we're just gonna go do that grab the groceries it's hailing right now um but the roads have pretty much cleared up so um we're pretty safe jared looks so cute in his new little fleece that he got for christmas super cute so update you later give you a little normal grocery haul All right, we are back from our Trader Joe's trip. We got stocked up on a lot of good stuff to cook. Tonight, I'm going to make a Tomka coconut soup. Uh, it's a delicious Thai soup. You can get it like any Thai place locally that you have. Um, but I'm gonna make one. It's gonna be really cute. So we got this crushed frozen ginger. Um, we also picked up cayenne pepper for that. Coconut, milk, got veggie broth got tons of different veggies so like shredded um carrots some chopped mushrooms some cilantro lots of good stuff so i'll show you that later um but we also picked up a ton of stuff for everyday kind of meal prep stuff um i got some of these cauliflower slims i've had these before these are really good like as mini pizzas <laughs> if you want with like mozzarella and like pizza sauce or marinara um, Jared got the pre-grilled chicken lemon pepper um, that he can just heat up and do like meal preps for work and we got tons of veggies to do like sheet pan veggies. I also picked up some kale, got lots of good stuff, some sa salad blends for lunch, obviously the hard cooked eggs, hard boiled eggs. Um, I wanted some celery, we got some like spreads, egg salad, more eggs, more milk, got some really healthy turmeric and ginger shots. I'm very healthy. Oh, and then I wanted to try this because apparently it's really good on like popcorn, but you can also put it on like veggies. It's just like the cheesy seasoning blend. So lots of that. Also stocked up on oranges, got a lime for the soup, some lemons, some uh, Fuji apples, a red onion, and berries. Also got creme fraiche down here. Um, really good on like eggs and stuff. Jared showed me the Gordon Ramsay trick, so. Anyway, we also got a mini thing of bread this time so that we don't feel like there's a lot of bread to use. Have a craving for toast or whatever, we can have that without having like a whole loaf of bread and like trying to like, I guess we're trying to become less dependent on the bread. So anyway, this is our haul. I will show you soup later when we cook. Jared has to wrap some of the last minute gifts that he got for Lauren, because Lauren's coming over. Um, we're gonna do our gift exchange today. So, starts class tomorrow. Oh, really weird. You're like the, it's like your second, second to last. Second to last, and then I'll have the whole thing done So exciting. June. Yep, and then he goes into his career. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. yeah I mean, confident, but it's just, you know, you never, you have imposter syndrome, that's how it is, yeah, always, but. I had to fight through that when, at the new job, so. 100%. Luckily, he's getting some mentorship from other people, though, yeah. so. Yeah, this is so exciting. And I don't really have anything this week, so it's gonna be pretty low-key. I'll show you what I cook, all of that fun stuff. We'll just have a little cozy week in.
That's really good. Yeah. It's nice and warming. Okay, we have the idea to add hard boiled eggs. I know you don't add hard boiled eggs to Asian dishes, but I'm too lazy to like cook them like that partial hard or whatever it takes. So we're just gonna put them in. I'm gonna add some sriracha. It's pretty like tame. The recipe is pretty tame in terms of spice. So I added more cayenne and pepper. The sriracha adds more flavor. Mm -hmm. I think I'll just continue to add sriracha. Wow, this fire. <laughs> I wanted to add eggs because there's no protein. I mean, there's protein like the veggies, but that's it. Also, I'll link the recipe down below. I added red pepper because um, I thought that would be nice. He doesn't love mushrooms, but mushroom coconut is like the point of the soup. So I figured I've seen different restaurants adding red bell pepper. It was a successful cooking journey. Thanks for joining along. Uh, Lauren is coming over with gifts in a little bit. And I have been working away. I got a ton of client work done and I need to write my post for my business now um, for January. So that's what we're gonna do next. I'm listening to smooth jazz music and it's just really getting me in the productive mood. Um, what a lovely way to come back to the daily grind, <laughs> the everyday stuff. Um, feeling really good. Merry Christmas. Jesus Christ. Um, oh, Lauren has her hair done too. Four and a half hour hair appointment. <laughs> I did not budget. Yeah, that was more than usual. <laughs> it's okay though. Well, she did like an Olaplex thing, oh. and a deep condition, and curled. It was a whole. Do you want to put those them. gifts in your little? Yeah, put them in my um, yeah. <laughs> Okay, I want to see you guys up in here. You need to first. get in here too. Thank you. How are you? Welcome. <gasps> Shut up. <laughs> Is that not everything? That is everything. I was like, oh, that's Jared. I was like, what can he use? Mug and IT stuff. And then I was that's like, that's literally the every part. person he's been talking to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you know what Jared loves? Burger King. King. And then I thought that also was like special to our production. I was just yeah. like, wow. Aww. So yeah. There you kisses. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Do you want to do his gifts to you first? Oh, sure. And then um, I think you and I should open our things together. Okay for the vlog. The vlog has been anticipating these matching robe moments. Ah, so. Let's go. They're not gonna look too far, far away. I'm guessing Star Wars. We don't know. Let's see. Oh, stop. <laughs> Why are we getting similar shoes? I know, I didn't even tell her. Well, like, stop. <laughs> baby Yoda, baby Yoda, baby, baby Yoda. <laughs> And then Santa's Queens. I don't know what this means, but I'm fucking ready to go. And then we saw it in the store, and I was like, oh my god, it's a pretty Mercury Funko Pop. <laughs> we were unwell. We were like, why do we, we want to get each other? And then I think you had the idea of like, a let's basket. do little baskets of like things we can use on our adventures. now half canceled adventures. But it's okay, we're not talking about that. Um, what, yeah, honestly, <laughs> if it gets fully canceled, we will still have a fun time. We'll go up to Seattle and just key. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be depressing, but it's fine. Hey, Fingers crossed. We'll drink it through. With the vodka that I forgot to order, but it will be coming eventually. We'll just have that for now. Yeah, it's yeah. fine. Bathe um, the blood, truly. <laughs> oh my god. New Year, save us. Yeah. Like the people different. change, but the taglines do the same. <laughs> anyway, we were browsing Etsy this night, and we decided on our basket theme, <laughs> and we said. Let's get matching robes. <laughs> so we got them! <laughs> yes! <laughs> we are so unwell! <laughs> hey! Hi! 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 
iconic. Iconic. I love a satin robe. So hopefully we'll have these for the beginning of March. Each like grab one thing. Sure. What is that? <gasps> Open it. I don't it have. Oh, that. oh God. Okay. I don't have. I don't have this one. I have a rose quartz. Right. Gua sha. I don't know how to say it. Okay, so. But you always talked about how you like them, okay. and I was like, oh my god. Oh, thank you. Put I put them in my fridge. I have a rose quartz roller, so she got me yeah. the jade roller. And then a gua sha. I think so. We don't know how to say that. Know. New trend. And Catherine's always like, doing, oh my god. You know? oh. It's a handmade, um, it's a little thing you put your, your drink in to keep oh, your I hands. I love drinks. Galantex who it. makes these little knitted things. And oh, so I was like, okay. What is this? this? Oh my god, it's so cute! It is a bunch of faces. Korea bitch, you fucking did it! Urban Outfitters. Oh, they nice. really popped off. Tony Moly. And they have Super a food mask bowl, so there's different like foods oh. in here. So cute. Oh my god, thank Ooh. you. My pleasure. I mean, it had to come out. It's like a fucking reflex now. Yeah. Mmm, <laughs> loosh. I don't want to take it out, but it's a little. I got you the butt. Like peach butt. Yep. A vitamin C serum, and it's good for your skin. And you can do like a little Ooh, facial. Fish. So like after you do See the foundation, I need that on uh -huh. my life. Oh my god, thank you. This is like big. I feel like snatched. Oh my god, thank you. <gasps> Belgian truffle box. Mm. <laughs> I saw that at Trader Joe's and that's it. And then we got, stop, what is this? It's a foot, foot mask. mask. Look at the cute little stocking. That's something you'll see every day. What is and this? And then more of our little eye. That's the box. Oh! This stuff. I swear it wasn't in there. Oh, <laughs> that's supposed to go in that. Oh! <laughs> I was like, what is it? <laughs> that goes in there. I don't know how it goes. Apologies. Yeah, no, it totally was not in there. Don't mind me. I love that. Ooh, okay. mask soap. Sleep. What's a dirt? I that's got that at Lori and Steph's little oh, apothecary gift shop. And um, yeah, and you can use it multiple times. This is gonna be so cute. So we can like, we're gonna match. Come we on. could do masks and oh, you uh, you were gonna have Alaska's vodka in your thing too. So once we get that, oh, like, we'll be drinking yeah. and we'll be doing masks and oh, that's the brand and eating chocolates and we're gonna thrive. Feels like a date night. It's so cute. I, I know. Love how they, like coordinate. And I know. Favorite couple in the room. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, happy Tuesday. Um, it's technically like 2 p.m. I've already had a client call and I uploaded my year in review. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, and now I'm making a little autumn veggie hash. We're gonna do some creme fraiche. I don't know how you say that, but uh, we're gonna whip up some eggs with that. I'm gonna put some kale into one here. Really mix it up. I just wanted like a healthy veggie egg hash. Uh, we're doing breakfast slash lunch. <laughs> Love my always pan. Love of my life. Here is my delicious breakfast. Some sriracha to top it off. Very excite. So I did one bell pepper. And then two lettuce wraps. And With turkey? Yep. With turkey and cheese and... Did you like mayo and mustard? Yeah, mayo Like just like a little mm. bit. And then a little hummus? Mm -hmm. He's not a big turkey guy, but. I like it if it's like organic, organic. Oh, bougie. Mm. He's off to do some schoolwork. He's got a lot going on. And I'm going to watch some Ghost Adventures um, Discovery Plus app if you are into like paranormal. It's the shit. Can't recommend it enough. So I'm going to catch up on some Ghost Adventures in this season and live my life, start my content, finish some client work. Having a very lazy night. Got a little cocoa bomb. I'm loving these things. Um, the little circular bomb things my parents got us. It's still like doing its thing. It's still dissolving. Um, super good. I tried the cinnamon and I personally like it a lot more than the salted caramel. Going through and looking at branding quotes um, from different female entrepreneurs here. Making some quotes here for my social and then planning it out. 
looking at you know latest news latest trends and thriving I already got a few scheduled um um, I have some beautiful images to work with this month, and I'm just taking it slow. It's been a pretty low-key day since my appointment, and I'm happy for that. Took a hair wash shower, and I'm just enjoying kind of my last day that's calm, because tomorrow I have quite a bit of calls in the morning, so making the most of it. Definitely performing way better than like their other methods of content. It's like the sharing the blog posts as articles, and then the videos. I think she produced great photos, so if, beautiful. if they like her, I think that's fine. New team shots. I feel like some of just the leaders. And then more variety, like them typing, working with their hands, like just more filler. Oh my god, that's so funny. He just emailed me. Oh, really? So like oh, we I do see. tag sponsors and stuff, but that's basically yeah. it. Good study growth. Mm -hmm. Like it's, it's popping. They really appreciate our comments, so. All right, happy Wednesday, folks. I haven't vlogged today. I had some meetings, as you saw. Um, and now I'm making dinner. I'm gonna do a sheet pan of veggies, just kind of what we had in the fridge. And I'm trying a new balsamic vinegar, olive oil <laughs> situation here. Hopefully it'll be good, add a bit more flavor. I also did the umami mushroom and company seasoning and garlic powder salt and pepper I might go for this smart tender thing um, jared's lunch is all packed he did um some frozen veggies um from the frozen section of trader joe's with his grilled chicken yeah i think i'll pop in two of these so just make two of these little grilled thingies okay tell me this doesn't look fantastic I just did like some pretty tame veggies, so um, I just wanted them to be kind of like wilted. Um, I didn't have any like, you know, root vegetables or whatever. Um, so yeah, didn't really need to go in for very long. And my little fig chicken is sauteing. I am obsessed with these plates. So thin, so nice. And with how flat they are, it was just really nice to be able to just move my rice around. It was just, oh my god, so nice. Look at me freaking out about plates. I am quite the millennial. All right, this is the finished plate. So excited. Um, I had about like double the amount for tomorrow night too, so that's super nice. It's going to stay in the fridge, and I'm very excited to taste test this balsamic vinegar mixture because I feel like it's really good. I'm gonna push through some client work and I feel good to go for the rest of the night. Good morning friends. I am going to make some breakfast. Had a lovely therapy session um, and just starting my day pretty slow. It's like 11.45 um, but had a great hour-long therapy kind of like a lunchtime and Jared is making ramen for late lunch early dinner I think so um I'm gonna actually have some of my leftovers from last night um the rice and veggies mix I'll do some <laughs> hard boiled eggs I have a bit of work to do so I'm going to get into that probably just take it easy watch like some ghost adventures there's also a new doc that um this guy uh tara lipinski if you like follow figure skating you'll know um her husband made and God, what is it called it's called meddled i think or meddling um and it's about like figure skating scandal so i'm very excited to watch that i believe it's on peacock so probably watch that we have also i'm gonna be real honest we have been binging the Real Housewives of Salt Lake. <laughs> I was like, I don't think I can do it. I just assumed they were like super like Republican and like conservative um, because duh, it's like Mormon County. Um, but they're actually like really progressive, um, a lot of them. So I have my faves for sure. Um, Stan Brooks Marks. So anyway, I'm just kind of obsessed. And we're living for the drama with Jen and everything. So I think we're only on episode like four of season two, but um, we're gonna get up there. Collusion and result fixing. There had to be some sort of quid pro quo. And here comes this FBI case. 
proliferation of spider web, male fraud, wire fraud. Good morning. I just had a great client call. Um, I got all done up today. I'm feeling myself for the premiere of RuPaul's Drag Race. I'm so excited. It's such a good cast. Um, and so much is happening. Our first cishet is joining the cast. Um, two black trans women. I'm thriving. This is going to be a great season. We ordered a charcuterie box. It's like a charcuterie creation um, from Veronica's Charcuterie. It is a local amazing female, I think Latinx owned company. Um, and I will link her down below as always. I love these little fun like creations. So um, love a good box. So she should be delivering in four hours. Um, so we're gonna have that for dinner. Um, I'm gonna make some lunch, just finish off my leftovers from yesterday, but I'm so, so excited. I had a great client strategy call and I have one more um, in about 50 minutes. So I'm gonna warm up this food. Check that baby out. Yum. All right. We're gonna go eat and I have an entire couch to clean off laundry and my suitcase when I'm done but we are going to eat some late breakfast lunch they're doing like an all vax thing for Jared's school so he is doing that he's wearing his N95 and it's only like vaxxed so we should be good um, but he is getting some like hands-on training because if you don't know he does IT so like he needs the in-person hands-on training and Miss Covita has not been able to provide that the past couple years. And he completed his degree like during COVID. So this is like the last couple quarters. And he's really trying to like soak up any time he can get with his professors and like all of that. So anyway, that's where he's at. This is iconic. Can use him for all sorts of things, especially eating. Mm. So good. I'm gonna watch some vlogs, pop on my call, and I get some work done after that. Cheers to a productive Friday. Oh my God, you guys, my charcuterie has arrived. Look how beautiful. Oh my gosh. Also, Veronica, so nice. I assume it's her name. I assume it's named after her. Um, oh my f also we got to like keep king talking about drag race i guess like someone she knows is like a designer to the stars knows angina knows a whole bunch of people so i'm just fangirling um and she's gonna be watching tonight so she put all of her favorite things in here for us i am so excited to dig in update friends I had a whole night planned. Lauren was gonna come over. We were gonna thrive. She was gonna spend the night. We have all been doing the best we can. They both work in service, so they're exposed anyway to the virus with how contagious it is. <clears throat> and another employee of his, like just potentially is gonna test positive. He has to cover their shift. It's a whole moment. Um, and now one of Lauren's housemates probably has it. So, um, and I assume it's confirmed because she told me it was confirmed. But anyway, we don't know what test this person took, but it's not looking good. They're like really sick and um, I don't think they have their booster. So reminder to get your booster if you can and you have not. Um, but our night has been effectively canceled. We will probably still be Zooming for the premiere, but now Jared and I have a whole box of charcuterie to enjoy. Um, luckily it'll keep in the fridge for a few days, so um, not too worried about it, but I'm so bummed because that was like our thing. And we were gonna kick it off right, and Lauren was gonna get out of the house and she was gonna have so much fun here. But you know what? It just goes to show you, Omicron is surging around the country. Um, and that's why personally, like I'm not gonna be eating like indoors at restaurants until this passes. Hopefully it will pass like in a couple months, but um, right now I just don't personally feel comfortable. And, you know, Jared's going to start wearing an N95 at work. That is the plan. We cleaned and tidied up the house, which, like, had to happen anyway. But we were kind of doing that for company. So that sucks. But the house is very nice and cleaned now. Um, very nice and fresh. 
went through paperwork, went through everything. So, um, yeah, that's all I got to say. He's doing the Apple Watch and he fixed my camera that I'm vlogging on. So you never, you no longer have a loose screw. You're not flopping around anymore. Um, and this is my beautiful Brita water filter bottle that he got for me that he set up. It's a lot today. We put like the rest of the Christmas stuff in storage and switched out the blankets and it was like a whole thing. So very productive day, but I think we're gonna eat some charcuterie now because I am starving, he is starving, and it's dinner time. So, turn of events, not what I had expected, but it's okay, we're gonna make it work. We are about to yep. pop into our premiere, and Lauren has health and wealth in her two fists. We've got alcohol to drink away the pain, vitamins to prevent the pain. And I was not going to record this part of my life. I says, you know, didn't really feel inspired. But then I was talking to one of my little Instagram friends and I was like, you know what? I actually am going to turn this into a mini series, the COVID diaries. Yes. There you go, bitch. Give that content. Hey, it's my iconic quote at the Chinese gardens. Um, lies. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> the weather report said that it wasn't going to be ready today. <laughs> Alternate facts. What did you say? Alternate facts. Fake news. Lies. <laughs> so we're not okay. The fact that we quote the blog, like we're very aware of that. I know. friends i am in bed for the night for the week i'm gonna wrap up the vlog here i hope you enjoyed this cozy week cooking and cleaning and just being low-key um i definitely think more of these are on my horizon um friends and i just don't really feel comfortable hanging out right now so it's gonna be a very low-key january but i'm very happy about that and jared has unfortunately come into contact with contacts of a contact um who have covid so we're just feeling a little uneasy but i feel like i'm in a better like mental place than i was before talked it out a bit with my parents and had a good night over there so anyway thanks for watching more to come in the next week vlog um but yeah it's really low-key so thanks for sticking around and i will see you next monday bye